And good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Sandy Bay Premier League. It is round two, and we'll recap of uh, last week's uh, round one. Brunswick coming out victors against Ringwood 6-4. And uh, Monash absolutely thumping Casey there. 6-1, a bit of a Bayern Munich Barcelona-esque performance there. But tonight, it is a big one. Williams Landing versus Monash. And... Uh, Williams Landing first game up tonight, so uh, they had a bye last week, so it'll be interesting to see how they go and Monash after that big, big victory, uh, uh, pretty much on top of the ladder at the moment. So we'll kick things off, we'll start with uh, the questions and uh, I think, I uh, believe, Team 1 will be Monash kicking off, so this is the first one, it's an EPL question, so get ready for this one. Alan Shearer has played for three clubs in his senior career in the English Premier League. Who were they? That's me, yeah? Yeah. Yeah, so we got um, Blackburn, Newcastle, and I'm going to say Southampton. Sounds good. Well, sounds like a winner there. Bang, spot on. You had well, Southampton, 88 to 92, Blackburn, 92 to 96, and his boyhood club, Newcastle, 96 to 2006. So, good start there from Monash. World Cup question now. Who <coughs> is the only player to have won the World Cup on three occasions? So, who is the only player to win the World Cup on three occasions? Win the World Cup on three occasions. That's a Monash question, isn't it? It's not? a Monash question. Oh, is it still a Monash? Yeah, so yeah. we'll play one side at a time. Bloody hell. Jeez. Oh. I'm looking at you, Pog. You look very confident in this one. Yes. Yes. Hey, coach. Do we need to sub? Do we need to sub? Yeah, get me out of wow. here. You can sub in this one. Uh, Mike, we're subbing you straight in. Um. Joel, I'll have a go. Um, I believe it was Pele. Uh, that is correct. Pele won 1958, 1962, and 1970. I'm like the fat kid at gym. <laughs> <laughs> The people just pick to fill out the numbers. Well, you got a you got a UCL question now. We can't sub anymore, which is going to be a problem. Oh, that's <laughs> so, right. Next one. Have you used your question a little bit early? The sub there, but next one. Ronaldo versus Messi question still to Monash. Who assisted Ronaldo's goal in a 2007 and 2008 final versus Chelsea? Who assisted? Ah, uh, is that a, are you talking which final? Champions League. Champions League final. Yeah. I should. I should really know this question. Um, but hold on. Is this Champions League question or Cristiano versus Ronaldo question? It's a Cristiano versus Ronaldo question. Yeah. Okay. Just making sure. Just making sure. <laughs> I want to say Anderson. Unfortunately, no. Yeah. <laughs> Can I throw it over to uh, yep. Williams so Landing? So on the counter. On the counter. Williams Landing. Who assisted Cristiano, Cristiano Ronaldo goal in the 2007-8 Champions League final versus Chelsea? So it's only the person that's um, playing the Ronaldo Messi question can answer it. Only me can answer? Yep. Um, I can see the cross from the right hand. Ronaldo with a header. Yep. yep. Who was it? Paul Scholes? Unfortunately, no. It was <laughs> Wes Brown. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Yeah. 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 Oh, right. This is a Champions League question. It's the final question for Monash. In the 1994 Champions League final, AC Milan won 4 0 over Barcelona. In that in the Barcelona team, they had three players in that squad who were not Spanish. Can wow. you name those three players? So who were not Spanish? So is that to me, or I'm now subbed off, subbed off because Nathan is on, or how does it work? Or am I still uh, taking you, the? Uh, you're still in there. I'm I'm on the I'm on the pine for good. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Right. Okay, so I'll have a go. So three Barcelona players who were yeah. not Spanish, yeah? In the 1994 final against AC Milan. Yeah, so it's going to be a bit of a stab, but I think uh, I can think of Romario. I can think of Stoichkov. 
and I can probably think uh, far, but maybe Laudrup. Close, but no cigar. Two out of the three are correct. So Williams Landing can get one now. If you can guess so the third Ronald person. Koeman. That is correct. Yeah. So Ronald Koeman, Risto Stoichkov, and Romario. Oh, yeah. So that's end of round one. Now we'll start Williams Landing. This is a Premier League question. So Andy Cole started his senior career at which club, only making one appearance, one appearance for this side? Andy Cole. Andy Cole, where did he start? Um, I know he played at... This is my answer. I know he played at Bristol City, I think, before... He made it big. Were they in the EPL at that stage? No, no, Bristol City never been in the in the EPL. I'm gonna go with I'm not sure to be honest. I'm gonna go with Arsenal. That is correct, Arsenal. Good oh. guess there. <laughs> well it. done. Wow. Well right done, Graham. Wow. <laughs> no <laughs> idea. I had next, no idea. Next question is the World Cup question is <coughs> which nation finished third in the first ever World Cup in 1930? Which nation? Uh, it's a good one, Alex. Uh, thank you for that question. Uh, <laughs> Let us spice things up a bit. Um, I'm going to... Uh, I'll have a stab, of course. Um, I'm going to say Sweden. Unfortunately, wrong. So, Monash, over to you. <laughs> Which right. country finished third in the we just got first a map World out Cup? Of, of the spot. Uh, in 1930. West Germany. West Germany? Incorrect. It is the US of A. <laughs> Next question is a Ronaldo and Messi question. Against which team did <clears throat> Ronald, uh, Lionel Messi score his only five goal haul? in the Champions League? Uh, was it a fellow Spanish team? Is it Can't a... say which team. It's in, the Euro it's in Europe, somewhere in Europe. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's way too much info. Is that is unbelievable. <laughs> Deportivo La Corona. No. Monash, throw it over to you. Which... Team, did Lionel Messi score again five goals against? Um, we've already used our sub, unfortunately. <laughs> That's a problem. <laughs> I'm gonna have to take a stab as well. Um, I'm gonna go with. Let's, let's go. Let's go. A minnow club like me. I would say someone like Liverpool, but that's too minnow. Probably someone small. Uh, yeah. <laughs> maybe a little bigger. Maybe a little better than Liverpool, possibly. Uh, <laughs> yeah, no idea. Um, let's go with the random one that we used last week, which is like Bucharest or something like that. Let's see with them. Wrong. It was Bayer Leverkusen. Oh, well, there you go. All right. Another Champions League question. This is another one. 1994 Champions League final. Can you name two of the three scorers in that final for AC Milan? That's me, isn't it? Yep. Um, I think... Oh, you... Oh. Is Daniela Massaro one? That is one. All right. Um, I think... Oh, was Van Basten still playing? Oh. You know, I just watched this about a month ago. <laughs> um, and that's why I remember Daniela Massaro. Um, oh, let's... Van Basten, Hullet, and Rijkaard. That, that's 
Unfortunately, wrong there. So we'll throw it over to Monash. Can you name two of the three scorers in the 94 Champions League oh, final two. for AC Milan? I think, well, Massaro and DC. That is correct. It was Daniela Massaro, <laughs> Dejan Savicevic, and Marcelo Sayuli. I couldn't remember the third one. Yep. <laughs> So Monash there taking it out. So uh, well, Rahit, final score, please. So three two at half time. Monash were up. I'll, take I'll, it. I'll, I'll, I'll step forward. This feels like the ninety eight World Cup when Holland asks who wants to step forward and up step <laughs> to belt one over the crossbar. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's kick things off. All right, so we'll kick off with so Monash started. So we'll start off with um, Williams landing. All right. Question is, which Borussia Dortmund player scored 16 seconds after coming on in the 1996-97 Champions League <laughs> final? Uh, 16 seconds. I'm trying to remember that squad now. Bit of top, yeah. <laughs> uh, you kill me. <laughs> It was uh, against Juve too, unfortunately. Was yeah. And was it the year before Ajax won it? Is that right? Uh, I think yes. No. Off the top of my head, I think it was. Um, I actually think I had his poster up on my wall. Um, now I've gone. I've gone a bit blank here. So yeah. hand, let's hand it over to Monash. Yeah. I was, Oh, let him have an answer. Let him have an answer. Yep, so over to me. Uh, uh, so I, can, can I yep. sub at all? Uh, yeah, you can sub yourself out. Oh. But you can't change once you're out. That's the thing. Yeah, no, nah, because I feel like uh, Mike knows this one. So, <laughs> uh, no, nah, I'm going to give it over to Graham. Graham, sub. Was it, was it sub? Okay. Yeah. Am I all okay answer now? Yeah, yep. you're going you're, you're gonna to take over. Yeah, I think it was Lars Ricken. Spot on. Lars Ricken scores after 16 seconds coming on. Good guess. That ties it up to three all now. Now it makes it more interesting. Next one. <laughs> Turkey's Hakan Suka scored the quickest World Cup goal in history against South Korea in 2002. But how, many, how long did it take for him to score? Are you looking for seconds or how many uh, minutes? No, so it goes to Mike now. So oh, it's Mike. Sorry. Yeah. Uh, um, how long did it take for him to score? Yeah. I'll say 31 seconds. Incorrect. So Williams landing. To take the lead, how long did Hakan Suka take the score against South Korea in the 2002 World Cup match? Tough one. It's just a stab in the dark as well. Uh, I'll go 25 seconds. Incorrect. We would answers we would have taken was 10.8 or 11 <laughs> seconds. 10.82, mate. 10.82. 10.8, fair enough. <laughs> okay, this one is another World Cup question. Which host World Cup is the only side to be elim eliminated in the group stages? So think of a host. So this is Williams Landing. Come on, Graham. Bring it home, son. Think about it, son. Take your time. <laughs> Take your time. Think about the host, man. Think about the host. Yeah, no, I know. Look, I've got one in mind, but I just... Can we mute them. Zeus, please? Can we mute Zeus? He's just coaching from the sideline. No, like, inspirational and motivation here, mate. All right? Only putting people down. That's all we accept. <laughs> Is to take the league. The pressure is on Graham. Yeah, I know. <laughs> okay, I'm going to go South Africa. Ooh, Ooh 
That is correct. Yes. South Africa in 2010. And Williams well Landing take the lead now. All down to the final question, Mike. Down to you. Which player from the UK has the most appearances in the Champions League? Mike needs this for to tie the game before we go into extra time. No extra time. <laughs> extra time. We, can use, we can use the free kick questions, can't we? Nah, it's a league table, that's why. So they get points. Pressure is on Mike. So when you say from UK, he he didn't necessarily have to appeal for the club. He just is himself a UK-based player, but he could have played for other clubs. He a UK-based player. So he could play for any club in Europe, but he's from the UK. Um, right here, okay. can we get a ruling on that? Um, so, was that a little clue that it... That was a clarification of... The, oh, I don't know, mate. There. I don't know. <laughs> the clarification of... I don't, know, G- I don't know, Jimmy. Can we mute him? Can we somehow mute Zeus? <laughs> yeah, I... Um, Zeus, I, unless... we, yeah, I was going to say, do we need... Do we, We've got a sub available. If, uh, if, I mean, Nathan, you look like you might know the answer. <laughs> oh, yeah, mate. Yeah. <laughs> What's the question? I, I, think, oh, Jesus. I think I'm relatively confident about the uh, answer. I I know, know, like, if somebody else in the team knows no, for no, sure, I, I'm happy I, to stop. I, I if you have a stab, if we want you to take it. Fair enough. All right. I'll have a stab. Uh, I'll say it's uh, David Beckham. Incorrect. Williams Landing. Just need you. You really in front four to three. I do believe on the scoreboard. This just to kill off the game. Which player from the UK has the most appearances in the Champions League? I'm going to go along Mike's route of thinking. There, I'm thinking Man United probably played the most amount of Champions League games over the last however long and. One of the longest serving players I can think of would be Ryan Giggs. Is, is that your final answer? Yeah, it is. <laughs> that is correct. My, well done, oh, Graham. You take Graham. it out. The and young Williams fella. Landing, take it out. 5-3. Close game there. But well done to Williams Landing. Great performance from you guys. Unlucky, my wish. Well played, guys. No, well, 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 Even money, you guys. Even money for relegation. What? Harsh. Ooh. But um, yeah, no. yeah, they must have known I was in the team. <laughs> <laughs> hey, we got to use that as motivation, lads. <laughs> got to get fired up. As I said, we're not we're not doing that here. We're only doing we're only doing. Who the- who, who else is in this uh, game? Which clubs? Casey. Um, what is it? So we've got Maidstone. Yeah, there was uh, that, okay. that, so who, ones you said it as well. So who's who's Monash got next? Um, I've got to have a look at the fixture. 